Hello my friends, you're joining me at the beginning of the engineering deck. Uh, engineering is unquestionably the hardest part of the game, so I think I'll do a quick inventory just to see what I've got. Let's get everything in order. Let's see. I've got a speed booster. Ah, my monkey brain is researching. Okay, I've got 11 health hypers. Let's download my weapons just so I can see how many bullets. Okay. I think I'll use a speed booster to get through here because it's irradiated. I'm just going to run for it. This is a, a, a kind of a maze-like area, but I've been through here so many times I know exactly where I'm going. Hmm. Oh. I'll to use a rad hypo. There's hybrid as well. Lovely can of cola. Security access compromised. Now listen carefully. Security access the Xenomorphs who have hijacked this ship are presumably from the surface of Tau City 5. They've been able to infect a number of crew members through an extremely invasive parasitical technique. They've also demonstrated the ability to control the actions of others through some form of limited telepathy. Find the research soft. Understand them, then kill them. Not sure what secrets you and your new buddy, Captain Diego, have got going up on Deck 3, but I intend to find out. If you continue to refuse to meet with me and my staff, you will leave me no choice but to register a complaint with corporate. If you want to take me seriously, perhaps Sergeant Bronson and her security staff will. Okay, through here is a new enemy. You do not know that. Only change. With your vision so small, you cannot see the value of our way. Now that voice was the many talking to me. And the robot was an exploding, malfunctioning service robot. They are very scary enemies. has both a male and female voice that talks at the same time as a monkey. And I can kill them in one shot now thanks to my monkey brain research. Would definitely be helpful. And then just a wonderful sound. Ah, 12 ammo piercing bullets. That's very precious. Security system offline. Oh, I'm hacking this security system because there are loads of camera... Oh, look at that. Severed head. That's great. I, I hacked security because there are loads of... Uh... Delacroix was right. This ship was not ready for prime time. Okay. The automatic safety seals have shut due to the radiation leak in the tubes. Oh, I down to engineering control. I think I can use the fluidics monitoring computer to purge the tubes. Cameras and sentry guns up ahead. This is a due to the recent confusion. There will be a ship-wide census tomorrow at 0900. 
All personnel, please report to the corner. This place is particularly scary because of these huge doors. It's a very claustrophobic environment and you can't see very far ahead. Which leaves you feeling very vulnerable. This place would be particularly hard for a non-hacker because there are two sentry guns here. But a non-hacker would have converted their skill, sorry, their cybernetic modules to other skills and abilities, which would probably make them more effective at dealing with these obstacles in a direct fashion. While I subvert them, but I'm not very effective at actually facing them. It's kind of hard to oh, see if I can reach this with melee. Probably not. But yeah, it's um, kind of hard to get an impression that System Shock 2 really facilitates multiple play styles um, just by watching a single class play. Ah, there's my first battery. I could use that on the Ramboster because it's uh, expired, but I think I'll save it. Um, I apologise if anybody has problems with flashing lights. One of my friends does. He has quite crazy eyes. Um, just keep your eyes closed or something. That's a health item, but I need to research it. I'm not really in a position sure to do this that. Is just what you were looking for. Right away, sir. I'm sure this uh. is uh. My standard tactic for dealing with the exploding robots is to run up to them and get just close enough that they explode and then run away to hopefully avoid the blast radius. And I did it successfully with the first robot, but didn't quite manage it with the second one. But uh, even taking a hit from the explosion beats using armor-piercing bullets on it, they're just too precious. A cutscene is about to play. Uh, I don't really have the time to discuss it in this episode. I think, anyway. So um, just enjoy the ep uh, the the awesome cutscene, and I'll discuss it in the next episode. One of the very few cutscenes in the game. Do you not trust the feelings of the flesh? Our biology yearns to join with you. We welcome you to our minds. But you puzzle us. Why do you serve our mother? How can you choose cold metal? over the splendor of flesh. But you fear us. We hear your thoughts, and they rage for your brothers you believe dead. But they are not. They sing in our symphony of life. We offer another chance to join us. If you choose to lie down with the machine, we will rend your heart and put you separate from the joy of the mass. <laughs>